Hello everyone, we're back. Barrow Hill. And I think we have a mouse cursor this time, if I did this correctly. Don't press new game. There we go. It's always so tempting. <laughs> so, cafe. There we are. Back here, I suppose. Yeah, there's not much here, though. We can do that. That's a pretty awful swing. We can make our own creepy sound effects. Great. Well, we have this. So, we can now dig up mushrooms, I suppose, if we were... <laughs> So inclined. Yes, we can go through that. Car is still on. Hmm. With the sunroof open. Let's uh, try going down the road a bit. Yeah, I guess. So, oh, lantern. where's our lantern? Here we are. Yes. Phone oh, box. They... Classic <laughs> British engineering. Very well. Look at it, it's very well done, very well lit. <laughs> well, there's your problem. Yeah, that's the problem we have. So, whatever is roving around in the darkness apparently is messing with the telephones. There's not much else here. Ooh, that was creepy. <laughs> the light makes everything look like it's got a big eye on it. It's kind of cool how you can't see that far ahead in the darkness. Hmm. Oh. Oh, now we can. <laughs> Moon. Good. Okay, so we're over here. Is this a oh, hello. Oh, oh, oh. I think I found our culprit. <laughs> hey, oh, oh yes, we want that. Yes, let's just get out on this thing. So, is there any way we can interact with this? I don't see any way. Yeah, I think... I think you can talk to the scarecrow. Is well, oh, it's one of those gotta, things you're gonna get at. things from the right angle. It's weird. It's like if you go left here. Oh, cool! You get an animation of it going over the. Here thing. we go. There's got to be something on this. Look at it. What's it guarding? Oh yeah. How is it that grey? They're meant to be in fields, aren't they? Why is it here? Well, that's why it's the culprit. It's just like <laughs> if any car comes around this corner, it's gonna be scared <laughs> and crash. Uh, I've lost my sense of direction, but I believe that, that way. this is the way to go. Oh, hey! Oh, he got scared by the scarecrow. This this looks a little suspicious. I don't think that's. I don't think that's how it's meant to be. Hmm. Do we need to write something down? I'm writing that down. That looks like an equation. What is four times six sixty-eight thousand five hundred seventy-eight? Just saying right now. <laughs> well, you wrote it down wrong. You wrote six eight five seven five. Well, if I take the five and turn it into an eight like that. Yeah, then... but you know, I think I'll be in charge of the pen from now on. <laughs> the Cornovia Weekly. Okay, it's the big goofy rock again. Oh yeah, I'm on the front page of a newspaper. Hooray! I'm so happy. Yay! Conrad um, Morse. I hope the rock is the culprit. I'm kind of rooting for him. Barrow Hill. Why are these everywhere? Is this just advertising Why with is litter? It, is it really that fabulous? Whoa. Oh, hey. Um, we have a thing up here. Remote. Oh, camera. Hmm. This is someone's photos of the Barrow Hill formation. Hey, they uh, put cameras up around the dig site then. Why did they just leave it here? Unless they didn't mean to. Got to use ghost hunting technology. Oh, cool! We got a map on us at uh, all times now. All right, cool. We have no idea where we are though. Notes. Okay. So these are set up to protect the dig site. Oh, we got another key code uh, now. Seven seven four. Oh, room three. Seven seven. Excellent. Nice. Um, this is good. Back to menu. Yeah, I don't think any of those actually do anything. Okay, so it did mention briefly there he's going crazy. Hmm. It's very... Uh... <laughs> Ooh, it's a rock. In Cornwall. You can get textbooks which tell you the complete history of wood. It's... Wow. And people are into that kind of thing, apparently. I think it's been around for a while, Wood. Same with rocks. I think they're quite old. Mm. Pretty basic stuff. I don't know. There are no words in this book. 
Well, it's Brian E. Clark's pop-up history book of rocks. No, it's accurate. They're, these are definitely rocks, and they're in Cornwall, I guess. Oh, we don't know that. Uh, they might be in Devon. Oh, hey, it tells you where they all were. <laughs> the huh. sentry. Okay, more whispers. Ancient monument. His hunter approaches. Ooh. I'm just reading this in my mind in the voice of the guy in the service station. It's coming for me. I hear the sentry <gasps> crashing through the undergrowth. It knows where I am. Knows why I tried to flee. <laughs> why didn't I listen more closely to the whispers? <laughs> Sorry, I'll stop. Because you would have been crazy to. It's just a story. It's, 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 it's not real. There's two uh, pages, but I can only pick up one. Hmm. Hey, a rock. <laughs> oh, it has a driving license, apparently. Conrad Morse. <laughs> we just keep putting it back in. We're not going to find his body in the truck, are we? I don't think so. I don't think uh, we need to write any of this down. I hope not. Okay. Let's we'll come back. Of course. Okay. That is a nice little jeep. Hmm. Radio, tune it. Can we actually do anything with this? Aha. Uh -huh. Luminous. It's like 16 point something, isn't it, Lucy? Okay. Somebody's messing about up here with me tonight. Freaking me out a little, which I assume was their idea. Why well, anybody wants to spend a night crashing about in the bushes, I don't know. Maybe Wimsy will see them off. I can't get an outside line, but hopefully you'll be able to call in to me here at Barrow Hill on 585-2131. It's exactly 15 minutes to 8. No, that can't be right. It looks like my clock stopped. Well, this is Emma Harry. Why not give me a call and let me know the correct time? The number again is 585 2131. I've lined up some more tunes to ease you into the night. So let's get down to business. That's pretty ominous. 585 2131. We can call Rubens FM. Wait, 2131, did you say? Yeah. Cool. On 15.3 uh, FM. Fabulous. Cool. That's ominous. Time to stop then. Huh. Interesting. Oh hey, we've uh, found the end of the road. Okay, so this is our zone of activity. Let's go back to the motel room. Yeah, let's um, let's go use that. Uh... Did the road split off there? I just wanted to check quickly. No, I'm. I'm... It's hard. It's hard to tell because it's dark. Yeah. Okay, so room there's... number three. Let's see what we can find in here. I don't know why you can't just step up onto that wooden platform. Why do you have to was, take the uh, stairs? Was it 777? 774. Okay. <laughs> you got to clear it, I guess. There we are. Oh. Oh, this is good. This is a good sign. Because whenever we go into a room like this, good things happen. I'm being hunted, but I have time to draw all of this. It's... On the wall. I'm not getting my deposit back. <laughs> Good things I don't do uh, any inspections at the service station. He watches his slumber. Okay, so... Okay, it's a top-down, so it's like a shallow hill. This is all probably going to come in useful later. Yeah. I think if it did, we could take it with us. If it were meant to keep meticulous notes... I doubt it. What are these, then, the sentries? Yeah, is that the claw of it? That looks like some kind of Techno acorn owl thing. Technological acorn. Yeah. With devil horns. Okay, that's an ogre of some kind. A leaf ogre. That's some kind of bird. I'm not really sure what that is. Birdfish. I don't know. He's very artistic, though. It's all done with a biro. It's quite nice. It's quite nice handwriting for... Uh, it's kind of... Okay, I can't really read that. <laughs> There. Um, well, I can, but I have to focus my eyes a lot. Phases of the moon and phallic moonstones. 
Mm, great. Uh, this looks like something we need. Are you up to date on your pagan mythology? What am I not? The amount of games we play with it in. What? Oh, hey, we can uh, rearrange this. Ooh. It's, it's a puzzle. Let's see. Okay, I think this is the top. My briefcase. Yeah. Okay. Um... Mm. No, mm. not no. there. I don't think it fits together perfectly. They, they don't. So you've I used. Just... I think that goes. My there. jeep. No. A solution. My jeep's number plate. <laughs> Told you. A solution can be found on my jeep's number plate. I hate maths. Ah. There we go. Yeah. My briefcase combination code is now reset. I've used a solution that can be found in my Jeep's number plate. Okay, I'll work on this. Okay, then. Uh, while you continue with the story. Oh, more Byron pictures. Yep, that's, uh, that's a tree. That is a claw. It's terrifying. Anyway. Ah, <laughs> oh, the horrors of fake Colgate toothpaste. It's called Quackies, of all things. No, wait, Quacksies. <laughs> okay. Once again, we can't interact with anything at the sink. Why does that bug me so much in every game? <laughs> oh, hey, you um, apparently tried stuffing notes down the toilet. Oh, yeah. <laughs> he sees us as vermin for messing with his rocks. My rocks. Okay, it looks like he's uh, going mad and the myths around this place are all true. If you mess with the rocks, you will end up trapped in some kind of bizarre closed off place where you're being hunted. Okay, I think I've got the combination. Could easily be wrong. Okay. It's been a long time since I've done multiplication. But, uh, yeah. Two seven four three one two. If we ever find a briefcase, mm. or have we already found one? Might be in here. Hmm. Okay. It's a fabulous development. Everything about Barrow Hill is fabulous. Yeah. Shower bathroom. Don't think we can turn on the shower, but that makes sense anyway. More pictures. Sweaters. Okay. I'm gonna. Yep. Here we are. Here's a briefcase. All right, two seven four. Okay. Oh. Yep. Three one two. Yeah. Way to go. Check out my math skills. <laughs> okay, scientific report. This Lucy. is that Lucy person. Lucy Summers. Okay. Okay. Uh, da, da. Once again, I'm leaving these up if you want to read. Yeah, it's all science. Soil and pottery. Hmm. The non stop action. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Just. <laughs> Maybe the creator is um, some kind of writer of, like, nature books. And he considered this the best platform for distributing them. Because there's so much crossover in terms of viewership of people who play Cornish indie, like, adventure point and click games. And people who want, would want to buy a nature book about pottery. You've got to learn which uh, mushrooms are poisonous. We already know. We have a book to tell us. Exactly. We're not going to read it. It's real life. going to compare the pictures. <laughs> I gotta give him credit for the vast amounts of detail here, but it's uh, yeah. That's the thing these games do have is a lot of ooh. Hello. It's beautiful. What's this? Huh? Are they are they giving off light? They're giving off heat. That's uh oh no magnetron. Okay, it's giving off some kind of magnetic magnetic impulse. Okay. 
Oh, that's interesting. It's magical. 